my tactic and I'm gonna make it clear because this will make you probably millions of dollars. <laughs> Okay, Google, stop. You saw that? Hey guys, welcome to my channel. <coughs> if you're new to my channel, my name is Jay. That was super dramatic. My room's a mess. I came back from LA. Sorry. Can you guys grab a snack? This is gonna be a chit chat. This is very off the cup. Off the cup? <laughs> so this is very off the cuff. If you're new to my channel, my name is Jay and I'm a entrepreneur slash obsessed with social media marketing and I'm here to help you grow your business or brand. So today we're talking about just every DM I get, which is I made a video about how engagement groups help you grow if you DM them, but not in the perspective that I imagined, which is selfish and kind of rude. I get a lot of messages just asking like, hey, can I join your engagement groups with the new update? It wasn't like this before, but I made it very clear that engagement groups aren't good for you anymore. I mean, like, just think about it. I want you guys to, like, I want to go over a few things on my honest thoughts. I want to make announcements to you guys about my new app kind of and then I'll talk to you about some other fun stuff and the fact that I might have a leg problem that was really concerning this morning okay okay so first let's just go over engagement groups just okay this is the thing I was in so many engagement groups I can pull up my phone right now and there were hundreds of people saying like my pick comment you know it, it was rounds basically what an engagement group is is a group of people who message each other to engage with each other's posts and then are committed to that every single day. Usually, they're pretty good. Sometimes they're f***ing trash. Like, nice pick, bro, and they comment like, nice shot, it's just so meaningless. Unless you're doing this for fun, which is fine. Like, do Instagram for fun and fill your own self-confidence, whatever your insecurity is. But long term, what does it matter if someone that you don't even know is commenting the same nice pick, bro? I don't think people realize that. I don't know why. I think it's just definitely insecurity in social media comments really help people out. My thing is I'm always like niche down and be nice. You guys know if you follow me on Instagram, which you should. <laughs> I think people need to realize if you get a comment from someone irrelevant to your market, it won't help you. It's just a waste of your time. If you guys realize engagement groups take hours sometimes to comment back on people's posts when you don't really care about their nice coffee selfie. People need to think about engagement groups for their niche. But not even that. What does it mean if someone blog Lottie's hashtag 101 comments nice pic? Ideally, engagement groups are helping you to get on the explore page. It's helping you to reach more followers. But people can smell bullshit looks tacky and frankly I don't have time for that it's just a lot of time I used to be in engagement groups and I don't know if you were ever experiencing this but they beat you down if you don't comment they're like she didn't comment in the past 24 hours kill her and I'm just like what the f I think people need to realize engagement groups are bad right now not for a reason of like comments are fine but Instagram's smelling the bull <laughs> and they're detecting whether people are in these pods which is you know the groups and they're they're literally shadow betting people because their algorithm can smell when someone's using it uh the way you can avoid it by the way is not using links to share just try to be very nonchalant or you can even f interact with your engagement group it's just weird when you're in a group of people and all you do is tell people to like and comment your post i feel like that's abuse just kidding i mean it's helpful for short term but for long term generally most of you guys want to create a business out of your influence it won't help you if puppy lover 101 is commenting the same every week just to help you get that one comment so you get on the explore page like the magic to getting that on the explore page is not comments it's actually watch time on my instagram i also talked about measuring the right variable so many of you guys are measuring like how many likes i get how many subscribers do i have now if anyone knows me in my circle you guys know that i don't measure subscriber counts at all i watch my analytics of watch time i am so obsessed with watch time i'm obsessed with audience retainment it's more appealing to measure the right variable which is how long someone's looking at your content or paying attention than to measure some random bullshit traffic of, I don't even know, like, you know, your likes or your followers. So I'm gonna go over the solution at the end and I wanna make a few things and announcements that will help you guys. I'm putting you guys on my water bottle, so there you go. <laughs> I have a very bad focus problem. I never really talk about my business or what I'm trying to do. You know, I wake up at some points really motivated and I don't think people realize like I'm really young for what I'm trying to do and it's kind of hard But I have very bad like ADHD I really can't focus and it's hard So sometimes during like me sending emails out I really can't focus and I just end up having a really unproductive day which damages me Do you ever have that like when you're not productive? Also, another thing, irrelevant but serious, there's a lump in my leg and I was just trying to like go on Google to see what the f happening it's not giant it's just like right there it's like on my leg like right there and i low-key thought i was gonna die this video is just interesting it's just a chit chat and i realized you know at this point with everyone here i need to make it fair so all my free is on youtube instagram media my blog all 
my social media is free free sh if you want to go on social media the quality is just as good okay it's all here youtube my ask jade show instagram dms even if you're serious i have the paid consultation call and i call you up for a session on how i can help you grow it's usually even like a week to week basis i have a monthly package for people who are serious keep in mind i never promote it because i only want people that are committed and it's i actually i turn a lot of people down and then now i'm really excited to announce something i've been working on for months oh my god i'm yelling you guys been seeing the behind the scenes of me developing my app with my father my dad we have a family marketing agency and we decided to create our own product i'm really excited to you know give you guys the scoop no one knows what the f it is so it's a personal branding app but before you go cringe and you're like, what the f is that? So the idea is, you know, engagement groups. So let's talk about engagement groups. Like it goes back to the power of a group is nice because a flood of comments is helpful to you if they're, you know, relatable. But it's, it makes you feel good. Having a group of people that you can ask to help you feels good. But the problem is it's, it sometimes doesn't work for people who are in a more serious niche who are actually creating a business. So why are you in an engagement group it's to keep you persistent you know you like people's photos it keeps you in the instagram game you're in a group of community it helps you grow like when you are with people who grow you grow why do you hire a personal trainer for diligence so imagine just like a personal branding you know mentor but on steroids like a trainer but on steroids and this steroid app is i will reveal the name but it's kind of cheesy but it's personal branding journey aka pbj like the f sandwich <laughs> No, this name is definitely in progress. I do like the idea of having a journey. It's gonna be coming out. It's very beta. It's very different than what I expected. Before, I was actually gonna create a app development company and it's not scalable when I realized how much work I had to put in um, developing an app. It's a lot of time, guys. It takes months, years even. This app is voice powered. I'm not trying to sell you guys anything, by the way. This app is, by the way, it's free, so. I thought I just announced that. I've never really told anyone what the f I'm doing. Okay, back to engagement groups. Whether you decide to go into one or not, doesn't matter. It's just how you're gonna use it. Are you gonna actually interact with people? Will it actually benefit your brand? Are they people that can help you? Is it your niche? Are they genuine f***ing people or f***ing bots? I just hopped off a coaching call with an amazing student. I'll pop her like Instagram here because she was so cute and amazing. Like I loved her message. And I just, she asked me like, Jay, should I do an engagement group? Because people are being successful off of it. And I think yes. I think you need to try it and don't ever listen to me. I mean, I've done everything, but like, you know, do your own but if it works for you, it works. I just think it's better to build an actual brand of giving value to people because when comments are more genuine, it makes you feel better. Also, when you're giving value and someone's actually consuming the content and they find you resourceful, it makes you a lot more money than just engage your groups. It might help you in the short term. Long term, I think you need to think about actually building an actual brand. In regards to everything I just said, the solution is try it and find a group that works. My tactic, and I'm gonna make it clear because this will make you probably millions of dollars. Direct message people in your target audience, but I niche down so it's more specific. Target people and message them and how you can help them. Whether it's making some art, maybe editing a video for them, meeting up for a photo shoot, or maybe just listening to their problems if you're like a trainer. Or if you are a podcaster, give them a piece of content. Just, just be valuable. Uh, make sure it makes sense. Don't do it for the sole reason to grow and get more followers. Do it for the sole reason to help people. Okay, it's not that hard. So many people are so selfish. Engagement groups are becoming so selfish. That's all I have to say. And match just like a hundred of them. Once you get a hundred people to say yes, which most likely will take you a while because conversions are lower when you're, you know, hustling, but don't worry, you're gonna get there. And then make a group out of those people. It's easy as that. Not really. Okay, so battery died. We're back in business. So about the app. When I launch it, which will be happening in this month soon, you'll see. I'll give you more information. I just want to know how I can help you. It's very beta, which means it's rough. Like, it doesn't look as pretty as, I don't know, Instagram, which is a multi-billion dollar company. I think I want to hear what you want to see. If that does come out, I'm really happy to just like have you guys fill in. For everyone in the Dharma Nation and you want to dominate social media, holy shit, that sounds so good. Someone commented below. By the way, congratulations to the comment winner. Shout out to the comment winner. Comment on this post to be featured in the next episode. If you want to be in the comment winner, I want you to comment if you have an Alexa or Google Home and if you use it. This app is very voice powered, uh, hint hint. And I will give you more information. It was just the first time me saying it out loud for the Dharma Nation. So yeah. Okay, I'll catch you guys in the next one. I hope this was helpful. I really do want to help you guys one on one. And if whether you're going to be on the Ask Jade show or think about a paid consulting call, click the link below. There's so much free.
I don't honestly I don't want you to buy anything for me But I do want to help you as much as possible time is limited, but I'm here for you I'll catch you guys in the next one Good bye What's up guys? Thank you so much for watching hold up if you could do me a huge favor, give this video a like and hit that subscribe button to turn on my post notifications. That would mean the world to me and I really appreciate it. Mwah.